And there's Stankford Ferry in once again on loading, panning on round, looking over to Porta Ferry. And the stump on the hill above Porta Ferry is not a castle or a tower house, it's the remnants of a windmill, I believe. And coming round here is another townhouse. And it looks in remarkably good nick. Uh, Strangford Castle. Very, very similar to the one at Kilcliffe. And I believe there's another one uh, at Art Glass. I'm not quite sure. And this is the plaque. Uh, most of Strangford Castle was built in the 16th century. It incorporates some work on the ground and first floor centuries from before. Simple three-storey stone townhouse, which once had wonderful views over Strangford Quays and Harbour to Porta Ferry on the other side, Porta Ferry Castle. It is almost square inside with walls that are over one metre thick. The tower rises 10 metres to the north and the building is built with rubble masonry and occasional large boulders. The entrance in the north-east wall was protected by maculation and the roof has very fine crenellations with pistol loops. The first floor fireplace contains an oven and the ground floor chamber is lit only by small gun loops and it, it refers to the other townhouses, Audley's Castle, Port of Ferry Castle, Cliff, Old Castle Ward are located in this area. Strangford Castle or Tower House. New door, obviously. But in very good nick, considering how old it, it is. And there we have it.